Hi, it's Wamzi. Just wanna make a quick video on foil gauge. Maybe my functioning or not working at all. I actually specifically for a friend, but I thought everyone could benefit from it, so I could make it for YouTube instead. First, we we'll talk about how foil gauge works. Okay, I have a foil pump here. So foil gauge is made up of three major parts. That is your float. Okay, you have a metal arm that connect the float and we have the resistor this is a variable resistor that varies why it been moved you understand so when your foil pump stops working there are three possible um, problems that could be causing it either the foot this uh, fluid and the uh, metal arm is stuck somewhere. If it's stuck like this and can't move, that means your tank will be showing full all the time. And if it's stuck like this and can't move, that means it will be showing empty all the time. Or you might have some electrical problem with the resistor. Okay. Or you can have program problem with your computer, your car computer which need resetting so i'll be talking on each of them so this is actually a fluid it's a buoyant substance and it works in accordance to um archimedes principle okay the archimedes the archimedes principle here which is fb equals to um pgv when fb um, represent the um, buoyant substance and p actually ref represent the fluid density g acceleration due to gravity and v the fluid volume so this is how um, the fluid works so when you put your liquid here it comes up and the more it comes up it oppresses this um, variable resistor here which gives the reading directly to your instrument cluster to some cars it gives the reading to the um, engine control module which in turn gives to the instrument cluster so now if your um, foil gauge is not working first you would like to take it to a technician a satisfied technician who would reset it and you can reset it actually by yourself by following um, this simple step first you turn on your ignition and hold the odometer button yes a button right here at the dashboard you hold it um, for some seconds until it comes to odometer mood okay then you turn off the ignition press and hold that same button again turn on your ignition and turn it off back with that you can reset your um, fire gauge and some other things but if that doesn't work if it's a mechanical or problem that means you will have to replace this part this resistor here it will lead you to removing your full foil pump and trying to reset and trying to um, replace this part here. Okay, so that just it for um, today. Thank you so much for what for watching. I hope you enjoy this video. And if you want, if you would like to see what the foil um, foil gauge looks like, it, I'll have to turn on some light and show you what it looks like. So it looks like something like this. I don't know if you can see. So that's it the foil gauge over there. As always, thank you so much for watching and see you in the next video I'm gonna make. Just making this video to help a lot of friends out there. I'm so sorry I don't have video editor. I don't edit my videos so there's no way I can make it to be as standard as you may think. It's going directly to YouTube like this. Thank you so much for watching and please subscribe. Stay tuned for more videos. Peace.